I think what people tend to miss is the incredible investment the carriers are going to put into their networks, uh, into every aspect of infrastructure to deliver 5G. Um, and the carriers are doing that, in my view, without a direct and simple line to a fair return. Um, and the carriers are going to have to build on top of it. You know, I was and am fortunate to have gone through all the G's. And I think 5G is going to be a much different G in that the focus on 5G is on use cases. Uh, every other G was about more volume and faster speeds. This one is, is getting that, you're gonna get that, but it's also about different use cases. And I, I think when you look at synchronous, we are in some pretty, uh, what I would say, incredibly good spaces to help the carriers. Uh, our largest product is our cloud product. We have a, a personal cloud product that is the largest, we are the largest player in that space in the globe. Uh, we've got, uh, great customers happen to have Verizon as our largest customer in that business. AT&T just lost, launched our product in Q1. Um, and it's a perfect example of an enhanced feature that the carrier can bring to the table with their own brand um, and give customers a choice as to where they want their all their content, all their videos, all their, their documents, et cetera, et cetera, to, to be stored and protected. Um, Synchronous does this well. Uh, our, our carriers are making a lot of money and great margins. And, and we think that's a great example of this. I'd say the second great example is the cross carrier messaging initiative. Um, obviously advanced messaging on top of RCS uh, in, the, in the US, um, T-Mobile, at and Team Verizon have put together a JV to get into that business. Um, we're very honored that we are their key partner in building that platform for them. And this is another example of utilizing 5G to deliver a completely new and enhanced digital experience for customers and, and really bring the carriers into a space where they have an opportunity not only to get into the A to P space, the business to consumer marketing space, but also to become a complete digital advertiser, digital brand play that the carriers have looked at in the past. And now this can bring that to them right on top of the 5G that they're building.